is what I realized because I took a long break from it. Mm-hmm. Um, and then now that I'm back on it, I realized that some of the same stuff that I didn't like about it before, not because of people, but because of myself, things that I see and make me feel a certain type of way, boom, boom, boom. I noticed that like the break didn't do anything. It's still there. It's still there. So this, so um, I realized that you know, there's things that I beat in my life, like things that I had to like overcome just to like be a better person mm-hmm. for myself. Like yo, I don't like, I don't like the fact that I'm doing this. Let me stop doing it. But guess what? It's not. It's not just as easy as like, oh, let me stop. No, it's hard. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? And stronger, right? Right. I say with social media, I was off it for so long that I thought. They're like, oh, I had beat this addiction. You know what I mean? Like, I had I had beat this thing. Mm-hmm. Um, and then I got back on it, and I realized, like, oh, nah, you just took a break. I didn't face it, like, with social media or and just my phone in general. But really, social media, since I got back on, it's like, what is this pull to, like, why I keep checking this shit every five minutes? <laughs> like, ten, every ten minutes, what am I checking, you know, and you're an ev- And you're an evolved human. Imagine for, like you know, a young person or or kids who grow up in that and don't even know a way to not be on social media.